I have the prompts here. Everyone is going to get the prompts because I want you all to practice marking. So take one, pass them down. If you need one, if I miss count, just let me know. when you have yours done and tell me what you marked and I'll mark it on mine. So in part A, what did you all mark? What did you decide was important that we need to mark? Mark? Rule? Why do you think the word rule is important? Because that's what you're trying to find out. Okay, because that's what you're trying to find out. What else is important in there? Um, we'll see. Um, three, because if you didn't like know, if you didn't know, if three wasn't there, you wouldn't know how many, um, how many, um, numbers. Writing. Think about some ways that we've seen patterns written in our work. 
Okay, is it is it just a list? Is it charts? What way can we display that? Okay, that's easy for someone to read and understand. Okay? And one more thing, Jared. I know you're anxious. Does it always have to go this way? Or can your chart go this way? Yeah. So if you don't have room to go horizontal, go vertical. Okay? wants us to take. And describe means to do what? What does describe mean, Morgan? Kind of, but explain is a different verb. So what does it mean, Taylor? Explain with adjectives. Yeah, to give details, right? So give details um, about the numbers in the pattern in their terms of being odd or even. What does it mean to be odd or even? What does it mean, Noah? Well, odd numbers are like numbers that Yes, that's a good explanation. Don't have they have pairs, right? Yes, they're they are composite except for two. Very good. Do you agree with him, Kyle? Do you agree with what Noah said? Do you want to add anything to it? No. Okay. Was that a pretty good answer? All right. Okay. Anything else we want to do to this? Morgan? Okay, I agree there. Anything else we want to do? Right? Terms. We don't use that word frequently. What does it mean? Forget. Who remembers what it means? Aiden, do you remember? Steps. Kind of the steps, like... We talked about terms being, well, we talked about terms like being the next numbers in the pattern. Right. What's the ninth term? What's the tenth term? So, but we use that in reference to that. Anything else before we get started? Noah? Uh, numbers, mm -hmm. think. Numbers, okay. Okay. 
circle thing because um, you want to underline it. Okay. Well, I'm not sure it's a power verb, but it is. You're right. We'll do it. We'll, I'll combine it. How about we, we underline and we circle it? The most important thing is we mark it, right? Okay. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to divide into groups of three. I'm going to give you this page. You guys know what to do with it. You're going to get a purple marker. And then I'm going to walk around, see how you're doing. If I want you to change something, I'm going to give you a different marker. Okay? So, groups of three. We're going to have you three here. There. As soon as you get your paper, you can go ahead and get started. You can go find a, a spot in the room. You can grab a board to write on. Uh, Rylan, Morgan, and Ryan. You three right here. Sam, you're going to come over here and join these two boys. Taylor, you gotta hold your own for this voice. 